Today on FPV 101, we're gonna be talking about how to solder. So, what is soldering? Soldering is a process used to join electrical components together using solder, a metal alloy. The process of soldering is what ties the system together, and it's what allows for the transfer of electricity to various components. Now, the idea of soldering may seem a little intimidating at first, but it's really not. After following along with the simple tutorial, you're gonna be a master solderer. That being said, you might wanna first start with the Learn to Solder Kit. It'll ensure that any beginner mistakes won't affect your newly purchased parts. The first thing you wanna do when soldering is grab your soldering iron or soldering pencil, and I ripped off a bit of solder here. It's really soft, so you should just be able to pull it right off with your hands. The first step is to tin the tip, which involves touching the tip of the solder to the tip of the iron. Then I'll put it in the brass wool, and this allows for the solder to spread evenly around the tip of the soldering iron surface. And then I'll touch it one more time just to have a nice point of contact here. And right away, I'm going to touch it to the pad. Now the pad's heating up right now, and the best method of soldering is to touch the solder to the opposite end, and it makes for a nice pool. Leave it there for a bit, and then we can pull away. When soldering, you wanna be sure to do it in a well-ventilated area. So it's best to have exhaust fans around and have the windows open. So we're gonna go ahead and attach one of the motors to our four-in-one ESC. First, I'm gonna take my snips here, press down just a little bit, just enough to squeeze the uh, outer coating of the wires and pull away without squeezing anymore. And go ahead and twist these so the strands of wire are nice and tight. I'm gonna go ahead and pre-tin these just like we did with the 4 one ESC. Touching one side, touch my solder to the other side. Touch the one side of the wires, touch the solder to the other side. It flowed pretty nicely. And once more, pull away. All right, now that I've tinned the 4 one ESC and I've also tinned our motor, I can just go ahead without any more solder and I should just be able to touch these wires to the 4 one ESC, press down with my iron and it'll drop in real nice. I wait for it to cool down. Now, these wires are actually getting hot on the inside when you touch your iron to it, so it might be best to use a set of tweezers. And I'm pressing down long enough so the solder on the wire melts and the solder on the 4-in-1 ESC melts. All right, and there you have it. Now, these are really good connections. I can go ahead, my 4-in-1 ESC is hot here, so be careful. I can go ahead and give them a little tug, nothing crazy, and you can see they held. And there you have it, it's just that simple.